A few weeks ago, I painted live at a wedding in St. Augustine, Florida. If you haven't heard about this, this is called live wedding painting. My name is Shawnee Lynn and I am a live wedding painter. Come with me as I travel to St. Augustine to capture this couple's special day on canvas. Before I make it to the wedding, I am in mommy mode. <laughs> I have two very energetic little ones that tend to wake me up with hungry bellies. So you know what that means. Gotta get breakfast going. Since this wedding is a few hours away, the kids will be staying with my parents. So of course, I have to make enough breakfast for all of us. Once everyone is nice and full, it's time for me to glamour up. This is one of my favorite parts of the job because I love getting all dolled up for these weddings. Once I'm all ready, it's time to kiss the kids goodbye and hit the road. It's about a two and a half hour drive to St. Augustine. And fortunately, I don't have to be the one driving. I leave that up to this guy. <laughs> While we're on the road, I like to look over my client's detail sheets. I put this together during the booking process so I know exactly what the couple wants captured in their painting. First stop, the hotel. Once we check in and drop off our bags, it's time to head over to the venue. This wedding was located at Kelly Farm Events Venue. It's a beautiful barn venue in St. Augustine and it actually has a working farm on site. Before I even set up my easel, I like to check out the space that will be painted. Right now I'm figuring out exactly how I wanna capture their first kiss. Typically I would do a straight on view of the bride and groom under the arch, but Tristan offered up a different perspective that I ended up liking a lot better. It was actually looking like it was about to rain exactly at the start of the ceremony, so I quickly sketched the Plan B ceremony location. Fortunately, the sky was clear at start time, and the outdoor ceremony was a success. The biggest moment for me to capture was the first kiss. Unfortunately though, I wasn't really happy with the actual kiss because the groom's arm was kind of oddly positioned. Because of this, I needed the photographer to pose them again. And let me tell you, my girl came through for me. Kelsey of Kelsey Breton's Photography did an amazing job and I am forever grateful for her. So now that I got the pose that I need, I can really get going on this painting. One of my absolute favorite parts about live wedding painting is the guest interactions. I love when guests come up to me and just want to talk about art. It's so much fun to get so many different perspectives.
And the most important reaction of all is, of course, the bride and groom. I'm still working on being able to complete the painting by the end of the night. But fortunately, I do tend to get them to a point where you have an idea of where it's going to end up. I'd say about 75% done. Once the bride and groom have seen the painting, it's time to pack it up and head back to the hotel. It was fun, but your girl is exhausted. The next day before we head back home, we hit up a Whataburger. They don't have any back in Orlando, so this was a definite treat. I take the painting back to my art studio to finish it up. As much as I love painting in front of a crowd, I definitely also enjoy the flexibility of being able to push and pull the colors and play with different ideas in the sanctity of my own art studio. And soon enough, it's time to put on those final details. the painting once it's all done. After that, I give it a full varnish myself just to be sure no spots were missed. Once it's dry, I flip it over, stamp it, leave a little note thanking the couple for including me in their special day and wishing them marital bliss. I leave them with a little thank you card that has their painting printed on the front. It's blank on the inside and again I leave a thank you note along with my business cards. so much for coming along with me in this journey of creating a live wedding painting for my couple. For more content like this, please like, share, and subscribe. 
And if you're interested in live wedding painting services with me, check out my website, shawneelinart.com. See you next time.